This video was originally recorded live over on Daz Let's Plays. Come join us next time. Ah, there's a cl there's a large cache of sparkling very close by and and nothing and nothing. Huh? I thought there would be the usual creature next to it. Might actually collect this one without any problems. Oh. Oh. Okay. I guess the last lair is the final level in the game. But well, before we take that on, we're going to go to the secret area from 8-C. We've gone to every other uh, secret exit in the game. So uh, let's not finish. Well, let's not break the tradition. Sure. Also, I'm rerouting my headphones. Somehow they were messed up in my wiring and I never noticed until now. Lovely. Okay. This should not take too long. I just need to sort of speed run through this all and then go to the last exit at the end. As long as I have like more than 15, I should be okay. So, I remember where the Pikmin are? Not at all. I'll find out soon enough. All right, come on, people. Hurry up. Oh my God. Come on. There you go. I have a sneaking suspicion that the uh, there's two endings. I have a sneaking suspicion that it's like you can go and go to this final boss, and it's like, wow, you did the game. And then if you do, if you get all the treasure, like you'll find that last sector, and that's probably all the boat. Like maybe that's the bonus boss. That's my sneaking suspicion. So I think even though we'll probably go to the last layer after this, there probably will be still more to the game. So I imagine we're going to the next. Like, we're, we're coming up to the normal ending, is what's going on. So, that's my sneaking suspicion. I don't actually know if this is true, and if not, then I'll just get the treasures anyway for fun. But I feel like we're going to do the last lair, and then go through the game and get those last treasures. Which I might even be able to do this week on this stream. In which case, I'll be done two weeks earlier than I thought I would be. I was expecting us to be done next week, in all honesty. Judging by just how long I thought the game was going to turn out, because I thought there were like ten sectors, not eight. Or maybe even nine. Um, so, I don't know. Um, in that case, I'll have like two casual streams I have to do. I know, I know how I want to do one. Uh, that's just dumb. You could see me coming out of them all, freaking trying to throw, and them not responding. I mean, I realized it was because they were busy, but even still, like, ugh. Um, but no, I've got two casual live streams, I guess I could do. We got the uh, one that I have planned and I sort of have an idea for, and then. Another one, I guess, with fans? Or I guess I could do a second version of that, because the thing I want to do where I'm just going to talk to the chat as I do something is very much going to be uh, probably longer than three hours, so I could probably do a couple live streams of it. Just a nice casual live stream to do on the side. I don't know. All right, you guys can go out of the way and whatever. Oh, right, yeah, we can't go that way. Gotcha. Come on, rocks. Singular rock. Uh, was there a secret up that way? Was it more Pikmin? I can't remember. Well, we'll wait. Sure. Dudes. Not allowed to be stuck. Well, we can go down this way. <gasps> oh, oh no, we never went here. Come on, buddy. All right, I probably just lost my copyright now because I was too quiet there and I just realized, but oh well. Urgh. I still get copyrights on pretty much like, well, not all of them, but a good chunk of Hey Pikmin videos now. Like it's, every live stream one's always been copyrighted because there's always a, always a 15 second second somewhere in the three hours that I play where I'm just completely silent and the game's like, oh yeah, damn, playing sound. And then I, I lose all the money on it, which is not fair. Oh, also I've been struck in a little bit with um, those um, this, this video is not suitable for for everyone. It's like, dude, I'm a family-friendly Let's Play channel playing Nintendo games that are designed for kids as well. Like, how am I not okay for advertisers? And apparently I'm not. Now, to be fair, actually, the one of my um, videos I requested a review for and it got denied. Oddly enough for not even, like... Right, there's a couple of things I want to say here. First of all, they won't even start to re like look at your manual request until you have a thousand views I don't 
get a thousand views all the time. So, I'm a small YouTuber, so I literally, there are times where they'll just take money and I can't stop it, even though it's clear that it's wrong, because I'm super family friendly, but it just robs me of money. I've, the, the requests are still sent and they'll go when they get a thousand, but that won't be till six months time, and by then, I'm not earning money from that video anymore, you know? Like, I earn money the first week from my videos, because that's the only time they get a significant amount of views, and after that, it's just nothing. I'm a small YouTuber, I've said this already, um, so, I don't know, man. But also, one of my, uh, Chibi Robo videos, I put in a request and it actually got denied. And, to be fair, it was titled The Massacre, because it was a massacre of how the smugglings got all a field of black flowers. That's very right, so I'm So just calling it, I guess I can make sense because the title was called The Massacre? But it's just a word. It, there wasn't an actual human massacre. There was an in-game... It's a description of a bad thing. I imagine if I changed it to the disaster, it probably would have had a similar effect. But it's very much like, this is still a family-friendly, child-okay, advertiser-great video. Just it has the word massacre in the title. I don't know. I'm very 50-50 on, okay, that makes sense, and whatever. And I, like, if, I imagine if I change the title of the video, I'm still not going to get any, I'm still not going to get any money out of it, so I might as well not. But it's like, if it's just the title, why don't you just tell me I can change it, and I'll change it, and then it will be great. I don't know, man. Anyway, Burning Bog is the level we were just in. No, this is 8-X. Let's go into it. Wow, I see a YouTuber called uh, Swagter gets one on every uh, game on uh, every video on a game called Bully because I guess because that's the word bully in it. Whatever, that's stupid. It's clear then that the system is looking for like titles. Oh, hello! It's looking for like titles for like it's partial part of it like system, which is kind of bad design. And but the fact that the review also actually no, because the review. Like, someone reviewed it and was like, oh, no, no, we're not accepting that. It says the massacre in it. It's still very lame. You know, it's like, it's a word. It doesn't mean human massacre every time. You can have a kid-friendly massacre. I, like, when I say that, I guess I can understand how you can't. But it, it's referring to flowers. You watch the video and you'll get it. I don't know, man. Yeah, YouTube is definitely... Someone said dead meat for small YouTubers. I can tell you, I'm certainly suffering, not the brunt of it. I'm sure people are, like get it worse than me, but I'm certainly suffering from this, especially since I don't have a job on the side. And you know, I'm trying to put, like part of the reason I tripled my output is to like cover, you know, my, my finances. But if this is also attacking me, I'm probably just have to, if I, if I have to get another job, it probably means I'm not gonna be able, like, it will be a cycle. The moment I get a real, a real job, sorry, a, an, another, another job, a job that's not YouTube, I'll have to put less time into YouTube, meaning I'll have less output onto YouTube, meaning I'll be getting less money from YouTube, meaning I'll disappear. Because I won't be, or I'll stop doing YouTube. I'll be doing less YouTube because I can't do YouTube. It's becoming unsustainable. I'm okay for now, just because I have savings and I'm going super budget this, like, year. Like, I've been giving myself a financial budget of, oh, I can spend this much today, and I'm doing great in it, you know? Like, I have money because I'm smart with it, but YouTube is certainly not paying me well. I'm a small YouTuber, and I'm suffering. Excuse me. Anyway, that's enough rambling about youtube -y stuff. Hello. So what are you? You're a dark plume of bad. A poison plume? Who knows? Level is hell to do no deaths. We'll find out. Let's grab these uh the sparkly emeralds. Don't like it. No, no, because that's a roof. All right, never mind. Excuse me. I'm sorry. I tried. Oops. There we go. I just realised I wasn't even paying attention to like most of this level. There we go. Now you latch on. Boom. Right. Give me these. Um, I'm gonna leave you guys be. 
but I can climb this myself. I feel like that was the wrong decision, but we'll find out. Uh, right, hello. What's going on? We got you again. Well, if you've got more treasure, I'll go grab some Pikmin. Don't mind me, I'll be back in a sec. <laughs> I just don't want to get them poisoned. Daz, don't leave YouTube, you're the best. I'll do my best to not lose it, but YouTube's trying to lose me. That's all I'm going to say on it now. Right. Hello, buddy. It's also a shame because I see a lot of people being like, you're very underrated. You do good content. You just don't have the numbers. I'm like, yeah. Welcome to life. I'm suc I'm, it's a miracle that I'm as big as I am. Or like, you know, because, uh, I don't know. A lot of my money nowadays, or like a lot of my views, a lot of my numbers just come from old videos. The fact that I made like Pikmin 3 speculation is still going quite strong. Like a lot of, I still get a lot of comments on it and it's really popular, but I don't know. People also really like my Pikmin 2 uh, Let's Play, you know, Pikmin Let's Plays do really well for me. Pikmin content does really well and that's good. It's basically the only thing keeping me afloat now and it's a shame. But hey, life gets hard. I'll just keep doing what I'm doing, hopefully making content better and better, and hopefully I'll slowly grow, not as any normal big YouTuber does where they just explode. I'm just going to grind my way up the system and hopefully slowly get bigger and better as I go. That's the game I have to play. I don't get a choice. Anyway, I, ke I keep saying that's the end of me talking about YouTube, but that's probably all I need to say. Okay? Right. And let's continue. You Pikmin? You are not. Go, oh, whoa, hello. I did not notice you were there. I probably should have guessed. That's a thick plume. Okay. And then I'll go here again. Lee. And up again. Nice. What's going on? Are you going to lose those sparkling seeds? Thank you. Congratulations for not losing your sparkling seeds. Okay. Uh, is that a tre That's a bomb rock. I'm not sure if I should have grabbed it, but I've got it now, so uh, we'll see how it how it fares. This is most likely death, but oh well. Oh, hello. Okay. Right, first pass it, thank you. Right. Oh, how is a Pikmin left behind? Well, I'm sorry. If you were just over there, then you're dumb. But I don't think you And no Pikmin up there. Nope. Okay. Alright, here's the hustly bit. On you. On you. Uh, just as I thought I timed it nice and well, and it was all good and dandy. No. But I'm guessing the secret is to carry this bomb rock the whole way and don't lose them. And then uh, you get the prize of whatever's on the end of this uh, river path. That makes sense. All right, we're going to the left to avoid you. Please actually get here, dude. Thank you. You can go. What else we got? Uh, Pikmin up there? No, of course not. I'm gonna drop on top of us here. Oh, and so are you. Bam, bam. Go to the left because of King Chomp Man. Hello. Anything else? Bam! Nope. Oh, how did I... Dude! Dude. Right, go to the left. How are you killing more? Good lord, Crumbug! I'm tapping you! Oof. Oof, this game. I can't handle all this. I think there's too many things going on screen right now. Whoa! Where was that one? I did not see that one. Alright, fine. Pick him in extinction. Cool. Oh, uh, did you see that coming? I didn't. It was just on top of me. Here's the bomb rock bit. Hey, look, it was a bishop. Do we get a mark for we brought no Pikmin back? But, oh. Uh, that crumbuck, you could see I was... Yeah, 100. That's it. Got some tangerine paste. 
no Pikmin. Uh, and now we have to slice forever to get through. I keep saying slice. I want to say slide through all this. There's only a... Oh, that'll be why. Because we got the last treasure, I guess. That was the last level. Uh, tangerine paste. Wonderful news. I found a tube filled with tangerines. My favorite fruit. Compressed into a juicy paste. But I only got a taste before the SS Dolphin 2 hastily told me it wasn't food. Funny. Didn't smell like paint to me. <laughs> Oops. Right, let's move on. Finishing the game with a Pikmin Extinction. How fitting. Right, now we can finally make our way to the final boss. Let's go. The last lair. With how many Pikmin do we have? <laughs> I doubt we're going to bring them all with us, but just in case we do, we have the end of Hey Pikmin as a first run, not going back for all the treasure yet. 375 reds, 252 yellows, 209 blues, 162 rocks, and 170 winged Pikmin. It's weird that... Oh, no! The numbers for the Pikmin are different colours for their colour, right? I can see that the 375 is slightly red. Like, it looks kind of pinkish and very light red. Yellow is very clearly yellow. Blue looks white to me. Rock looks like a darker white, so I'm guessing it's supposed to be grey. And I guess I can see the wing just pink. They, the, the blue rock and wing just look like slightly different brightnesses of white. And I guess that is kind of what their colour is. But it just looks like they're supposed to be white and it's just faded. Like, yellow is very clearly yellow. It's very strongly contrasting. I don't know, that's weird. Oh well, whatever. Anyway, that is all the Pikmin we have. Let's go to... <sighs> the last lair.